Hello, YouTubers out there. This is Mr. Hamster991, continuing the Tomb Raider 1 complete LP. Now, last time I did the end of the cistern, and I said I may not do too much Ethiopian today, but today I actually am going to do too much Ethiopian. Basically, the last two levels of the grease section in this game are mainly water based. Like I said back in Palace Midas, I will do the centaurs. I will be I will beat them. I mean I did practice this level before I recorded. And right here there's a double dart trap. Should be careful. Alright, now you want to go up here and pull this lever. You want to go down here and get a small mic. Now, there are only two secrets in this level. There's also one secret in the Egypt level sanctuary of the Skion. And the secret is a. Uh, don't want to spoil it, but actually, probably already know. All of you probably already know. The secret is uh, Uzis. The Uzis. In the sanctuary of the Skion. The only secret is the Uzis. And it's on the in invisible platform. Once you get up here, there's going to be a rat. Like the main enemy in Greece, probably the last three levels are the rats. They're everywhere. And then if you want to turn, go ahead and turn around. There are two ways to get up here, like to progress in this level. And there's this way, which is probably easier, or it's that way. And climb up. But we actually want to go this way because we want to get the first secret and we want to face Pierre. I really don't want to face Pierre, but we have to go the anyway. way. I'm going to use my shotguns to take care of Pierre. This won't be the final time we kill Pierre or we face Pierre. It's the second to last. Go away! And he's gone. Sometimes he just won't vanish. Alright, there's another one of these gate clashes things. This one walked through it. If you stand like right in front of it, you will die instantly. It happened to me a few times. First secret, they may look like these are the secrets, but it's not. There's like an invisible door over there. What you want to do is you want to step on these three spots. One, and two, and three. Then a door will open. Then you want to just go over here. Jump, jump, and jump. There you go. All it's in here is a large med pack and some shotgun shells. And you can also collect these too, the little extras. I 
And now that you're done with that, you want to go back up here. Because we want to, there's a switch that will raise the water. That's what we want to do. You gotta time yourself when you go through those, because you can in you can kill yourself instantly. Okay, now that we're done with that, we want to go over here. Watch out for that saw. It may take damage from them. Save the game right here. I'm not going to end the video. You should actually jump over here and get those shotgun shells. I probably recommend it because I'm going to. You want probably want to use the shotgun shells for Pierre because you might want to use the um, Magnum Memo for the centaurs. There we go. What to do now? Yeah, see, so you might take damage when you do the running jump over here, but that's okay. As long as, as, long as you time itself right, your, yourself right, you can take the slightest amount of damage. You don't even have to take that much damage at all. Once you get over here, you're not even halfway done with this level. There's still a lot more to do. And the second secret is a one shot only one, so might oh yeah, I said might take a few tries to do that. But really this level ain't at all hard. It's just it just has so much puzzles. Now what you wanna do is you wanna go over here. Just ignore that rat, just jump through it. And I'm not sure if there's any way you can go through this path without swimming in it because it just seems highly impossible or highly uncertain. Huh. Just stand it there and let me kill him. Now I'm not going that way. We need a gold key for that. There's like two gold keys in this level. I'm going to go over here and pull this lever. It's not that much help hidden. It opens a door up there where the gorillas are. I'm going to go and kill them with my shotgun. I'll go ahead and save the game just in case I die or they push me up in the spikes. This game saves pretty quick, actually. Unlike the two and three. Oh my god, why won't he die? Right. Um, when I practiced this level, it took me at least seven shotgun bullets to kill Pierre. So I thought, I'm like, I'm just gonna go and save my ammo and just kill him with the pistols might take a while though. Here's the first golden key. Why don't you go ahead and jump? And land right here. Funny thing about this part is where if you pull your pistols up or any gun up immediately when you put the key in, look over there and then holster your gun. It's kind of funny. You know, like instantly it just ship it just ships to when you put the key in. It's hilarious. I mean, like even the wall changes over here. There's a some med packs. Alright, so w the puzzle here is to push this block onto one of the one of those floors. Yes, there's floors. Those floors that have the words written on them and like some form of letters. 
Only two of them lead to a rusty key. This one leads to a gorilla door. But there are some goodies in there. I'm going to kill that gorilla. <coughs> And when, when he's dead, he can go in there. And there's gonna be some magnum clips. Your rats. And some shotgun shells. If you push it on this one, <coughs> or on the tile right next to it, or just north from it, you're gonna open two doors, or basically one door. And that's two doors. Pretty sure there's a gorilla in there. Now let's hear some more shotgun shells. Don't push it yet because there's another door that opens up here. But watch out for those okay, those, those clashing wall. Okay. What's in here? See this is a large my pack. And the rusty one of the rusty keys. The next one, just west from it, opens a cage that, or opens a door that has about five rats in it. I want to just stand on this so I can kill them. Here's a small mid pack. Alright, now for the last tile, it opens a door with a two double boulder trap. It's actually a double freaking boulder trap. It's pretty easy, but there's a small mid pack in front of the boulder trap. Don't grab it when you go in there, you're gonna die. Trust me, I don't want to die right now. All I have to do is that. Just step, step off the platform and then run for a few, a, like a second, and then just jump and grab it when you get out. And now that we got both of the rusty keys, we can actually. But when you when you open this door, it's not the end of the level. We still got the centaurs and Pierre, and this slide leads to the. There's a slide um, in the inside the door or inside here. It actually leads um, to the room with the centaurs. All right, that is all, guys. This is that is all for well, not all for today, but that's that's it for this video. This is Mr. Amsterdam 991 signing out. Goodbye. We. Don't you just love glitches?